What's going on guys? It's your boy Bona Man Day and today we're going to be talking about the Rapid Fire Ballista. It fires physical bolts that penetrate to hit multiple enemies, mountable or scenario only. You have to deal 10,000 damage to unlock the unique upgrades, which is to either bleed enemies on hit or stun enemies hit. I typically prefer stun because the amount of damage that you're doing is disproportionate to the amount of damage you increase with bleed. <clears throat> so I prefer stun also because it's really good against bosses and bosses happen in more scenarios. So I'd rather stun them in place and nerk them before they get in my kill box. Looking at you, Gorbash. Or Craig. It's really good for those guys. For sure. Or for an armored ogre, mountain trolls, and stuff like that. I still think the bleed helps enough. Unless it was like a really, really heavy bleed, then sure. Maybe. But it's not. So the raw output of damage, I think, works better with stun. But I, you could run bleed. You could run bleed, and you'd be fine. Let me know. Let me know what you think about those unique upgrades. All right, let's go ahead and jump into the game files. So the first thing to know, it has an interaction distance of 500. It is one of the two mountable uh, items in the game, the other one being the uh, Mega Boom Barrel Launcher, which we've already covered. But this interactable distance also affects... The cauldrons that you pour, and it also affects the beehive if you want to drop it without attacking it as well. So you have to you do have to be within a certain amount of range for things to activate them, and this is one of those things. And you have a coin value of twenty eight hundred. It costs six goals to unlock. Uh primary damage though is eighty. In the upgrades, we have two things. We have bleeds enemy on hit. Bleeds enemies hit. I can read that right. And that applies the decoy bleed. The decoy bleed is for three seconds, eight damage a second. The other upgrade is to stun enemies hit, uses the crossbow stun. Crossbow stun is for three seconds. That's really all there is to it. Let's jump into a game and take a look at what it looks like. So here's what it looks like when you place it. You can hop in. If you're within 3.3 grid squares, should be about right there. Yeah, from the center. As you fire it, it shoots four different bolts, which is pretty sweet, if you ask me. And it shoots them really far. You can see them colliding with the mountain in the back. This is the farthest distance you're ever going to shoot something in a straight line. Probably, I think. Pretty sure. And you can see just how crazy good this is. It easily mowed down so many orcs. It's binoculars, let me tell you. Got guys over the door. That's cute. Can't destroy our own door though, so that's good. We can trigger the cauldron and everything. Look at that. So that's the uh, rapid fire ballista for you, guys. As always, don't forget to leave a like, comment, subscribe, follow our stream on Twitch, upload to YouTube, and I'll catch you on the flip side. All right, deuces.